Good morning. So today I'm heading off to have a look at the motorhome show in Hamilton. So if you're interested, keep watching. In your purple Toyota, the morning is waking slow and the traffic's not moving. Hi and welcome back. Um, so today I'm getting a ride into this motorhome show, which is quite good. I don't have to take the truck in because I don't really want to stay there for days. Um, one day is enough. So my lovely neighbours and friends, Harry and Lorraine, have offered me a ride in their car. So I'm going to head in there with my camera and see what I can film because I've never been to one before and have no idea what to expect. Hey guys, so I'm at my first ever motorhome show. I've never been to one before. And where have I found myself? But in Memory Lane, which I guess suits kind of what I'm all about. So I'm going to have a good look at this and show you some of these cool old caravans. Wow, that's a um, real adventure vehicle, isn't it? Look at that one. Isn't that cool? Not something you'd want to live in, but if you were off for the weekend to somewhere rugged and wanted to go out and go kayaking and mountain biking, it's pretty cool. Okay, I'm just sitting here having a drink of water and eating some nuts and having a chill out because yeah, I've totally lost Harry and Lorraine who I came here with. No idea where they are but luckily we exchanged phone numbers before we both wandered, wandered off. And um, it's been very interesting. I've only actually gone into one motorhome and had a look at that, um, which was interesting. I'd always wanted to have a look in one of those. Um, it was very big and a lot of interesting products and things like that but no technology that made me go oh my god that's amazing you know it's hmm, a lot of things for sale i'm sure if you had a big fat checkbook you could seriously do some damage here um things that i like looking at were electric bikes i like chatting to the guy who sells the quarter acre pots um because I have contemplated one of those. I don't eat meat, so I'm not going to do big rip meat things in it. But for things that take a while to cook, like um, brown rice and lentils and chickpeas and stuff, I eat. Because I quite often just buy the tinned ones because it's quicker. I don't have to cook them for as long. So, hmm, interesting. And yeah, ladies selling some really good turmeric products and lots and lots of bits and pieces for motorhomes aerials attachments cutlery crockery kitchen things and so many motorhomes for sale it's really quite amazing um i think if you came here to buy one you could totally confuse yourself quite quickly Thank you. 
So yeah, I've just got back from the motorhome show and yeah, it sure was interesting. I ended up being most intrigued by the retro stuff and things like that because yeah, there were so many brand new motorhomes there. It really was um, a little bit overwhelming and they kind of all blur into <laughs> looking the same. So the retro stuff, I was really impressed with the variety of stands there, you know, it wasn't just things for motorhomes, there were all sorts of other things, and health related things and stuff like that, which interested me, so yeah, it was an interesting day, I'm glad I didn't go there and stay though, because I sort of prefer not being sardined in with hundreds of other people, um, and especially since Miss Pussycat, my little travel companion, has been a little bit off colour lately. I'm not quite sure what's up with that. But something like that would have just actually stressed her. So she was better off staying home and relaxing and sleeping and doing what she does. So thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video or want to see more of the videos of what I'm up to, um, please like and subscribe. And yeah, next weekend I'm working at the Woodfest in Kaurau, so that's always an interesting event. It's not really motorhome orientated, but it certainly is interesting, so I'm hoping to get some filming done there too. Um, I've been there before, worked there before with a fair I used to travel with, and it was really quite neat. So lots of love everyone, and I'll see you all in my next video. Thank you.